very scared because I couldn't believe it was happening where I was at. It was right behind me. You know what I'm saying? Basically, it was right behind me. Around 6.30 p.m. on Friday, Latasha Joyner was shopping with her children when a shooting broke out at the Greenville Mall. Next down, I know we heard two gunshots, pow, pow, and everybody dropped. That's when she jumped into action to get her children to safety. Ran to the car, to my other three, two kids to the car, and then I went back to back up and by the work to go get my other three kids. But during that time, they done locked the gates. They done locked the gates in Bay Up and Body Works. So everybody was going to the back, back of the store. So they was like, you gotta wait until the police say it's safe. She went back in. She was able to get this video of people attempting to help two victims. The victims have been identified as 21-year-old Theodore Devon Don Jr. and 22-year-old Rashad Perkins. They were both taken to ECU Health for treatment. Police confirmed with one of the victims the shooting started out as a fight and that it was an isolated incident. The incident for Joyner still calls safety into question. I feel like in the future they need to get metal detectors out there and better security. That's what I feel like they need to do because at this point they got kids that's coming in. It's increased safety like this that she says could help her feel more comfortable shopping in places like malls. When people start shooting, you dropping your bags, losing your clothes. So, the, you know, you're taking, your, you're taking a loss. And, you know, I feel like they need to make it more safer than what they got going on.